Welcome to the VA3JPX YouTube channel. Well, good day, good day, everybody. It's James, VA3JPX, and welcome to another YouTube video. Uh, what I wanted to show you today was a little functionality that I find really interesting in the Ham Radio Deluxe software. Um, that's the software I use to remotely control my FT950 and my FT847. Um, in the uh, Digital Master 780 or DM780 component of Ham Radio Deluxe, it has a feature called Super Browser. And what that is, is it allows you to monitor multiple PSK31 um, uh, signals in one actual browser. So I have it launched right here. And you can see um, there, there's a few QSOs that I'm, that I'm getting here. Uh, but you, if you take a look at the time, it's it's just shortly after 8 p.m. Eastern time when I recorded this video, so there's not a lot of PSK31 traffic uh, due to the conditions of 20 meters at this time. But, uh, you know, you can see there's a few QSOs that I'm tracking here. Um, one of the coolest features, I think, of this software is it allows you to report the call signs that you're hearing, that you're actually picking up, uh, in the super browser and reporting it to a server on the internet where you can go to a, a website, say 15, 20 minutes later, and take a look, search for your call sign, and it'll list all the stations that you heard. Um, I think it only keeps it for maybe a day or two, but it lists all the stations that you heard or your software has picked up and the distance that they were uh, you know, like if 1,000, 2,000 miles away or something like that. Um, so that's a really neat feature. It allows you to basically, if you want, you can leave your uh, Digital Master Super Browser open for for a day or two and then just, just have it monitoring and it'll report the call signs that it picks up to that website and you can just go after a couple of days and just have a look and see how many hundreds of stations that you've heard and how far away they are. I, th I think it's really kind of neat anyway. Simply click on Program Options and then pick uh, PSK Reporter. And then here, you just basically set the defaults. You just basically put in your, uh, your two check marks here so that it logs it and reports it. And then um, you click OK. And the next time you launch, uh, Digital Master Super Browser, it'll automatically connect to this website right here, uh, or server, I should say, and report the stations that you're hearing. You also want to make sure that in your configuration for the Digital Master 780 that you also include your call sign and your grid locator. Um, don't worry about the antenna or anything else like that, but make sure you have these two because that's what's going to cal the, the grid locator is what's going to calculate the distance between you and the stations that you're receiving. And that information in return is going to be uploaded to the server. So that's a real neat feature. Um, let's, uh, let's flip over to a web browser and see what stations I've picked up uh, in the last little while. Let's check this out. Okay, so here's the pskreporter.info website. And um, I think it's one of a kind right now, at least as as of 2014, I haven't seen any other website do what this website does. Kind of neat. Um, let's uh, let's have a look here. Um, let's go show signals received by the call sign VA3JPX. All modes, and let's just go say within the last hour. Um, hit go. Okay, now because I literally just fired this up to do the video, these are the only stations that I've picked up. But it's kind of neat, you know, so like if you just hover your mouse over it, it will tell you uh, this is the station. Uh, it was uh, 2,136 kilometers away at a bearing of 246 degrees. The frequency was 14070. Um, this person over here in Miami, Florida, you see their information right there as well. So it's kind of neat. So if you let it go for a couple of days, you'd be amazed at the stations that you pick up. And uh, Now, on the other hand, let's say you 
are using PSK31 yourself, or maybe even 63 or 125, uh, and you want to see what stations are, are hearing you, uh, which you can do if you want, is go to this website and just flip this from received by to sent by. All modes um, and a time frame. You know, you could do up to 24 hours, hit go. And it'll show you all of the stations that were running Super Browser and uh, if they heard you or not. So you'd be surprised, even at 10 watts or 5, sometimes even 15. Um, you know, even f sometimes 15, you'll find that you're not getting across North America, but you're getting into Europe, you know what I mean? Uh, and then in other occasions, you'll find that 5 watts is just getting you right clear into Europe and all across uh, North America. It's kind of neat. So I thought I'd share that with you if you're kind of new to the digital modes and the... Uh, the software, uh, Digital Master 780. It's part of the Ham Radio Deluxe uh, suite. So check it out. I'll leave some links below to the software. If you have any questions or comments, leave them in the comment section below. And I hope you enjoyed the video. Take care, 7-3, and keep on rocking.